Hi. Welcome. Hi, how are you? Thank you for joining us. I am Jakai, and I am a fourth grader here at Glenwood Academy. My name is Envy, and I'm in fifth grade. My name is Caprina, and I'm in third grade. My name is Morris, and I'm in fifth grade. My name is Brianna, and I'm in fourth grade. My name is Mirosa, and I am in fifth grade. And we are your hosts for the evening. You might be wondering why I'm so excited. It's because today is a very special day. Today, my friends and I get to tell you about all the cool things that happen at Glenwood Academy. Of course, showing you around in person will be more fun, but since we're not able to do that yet, we hope this virtual look around Glenwood is almost as good. Glenwood Academy is an awesome place. The teachers are so helpful. And my favorite subject is science. The house fans make the cottages feel like home. Glenwood Academy is really great. We have so many after-school activities to choose from, like volleyball and kids' shop. We have a movie night every Thursday, and every day we have academic power hour, where we work on our homework. That part's not so fun. I love power hour. I'm good at homework. I really like robotics club and band. Plus, if you ever need extra help in school, you can go to the Learning Research Center. I'm so glad to be here. But the reason we are all here is because of you. you. That's right. Your support makes Glenwood Academy possible. Your support has given us the opportunity to become our very best. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Tonight, you're going to hear some amazing stories from students and families. We're going to tell you why we love Glenwood Academy and how it has made a difference in our lives. All right, Zamarius, what do we have up next? This is going to be awesome. Sit back and relax and learn what we've been up to at Glenwood. At Glenwood Academy, we provide life-changing, empowering programs for our students. Our goal is to foster a whole child education, which includes academics, social and emotional skills, recreation, and culture. What makes us especially unique is our residential program. We are the only residential school in Illinois and our 120-acre campus provides the optimal environment for our students to thrive in every aspect of their lives. Students live in cottages on our campus, which have full-time, live-in house parents. These residential cottages are designed to model a family environment with a living area, recreation area, kitchen, bedrooms, and bathrooms. Students living in the cottages rotate household responsibilities, which help to build knowledge and self-confidence. Personal well-being and hygiene education are also taught. Our academic program is designed to bring out our students' highest learning potential. Most of our students arrive at Glenwood performing behind their grade level. By coming to Glenwood, our students receive a solid private school education, preparing them for success in life. For students who have learning challenges, our Learning Resource Center provides one-on-one -on -one support, helping each student develop proficiency in academic and study skills. We continue to see tremendous academic growth in our students throughout their time at Glenwood. The emotional well-being of our students and their families is paramount at Glenwood Academy. Our Counseling Services program helps our students develop emotional and mental health through on-campus therapy. We provide 100% of our students with access to mental health care, including individual, group, and family therapy when appropriate. We accomplish this by designing our programs through an approach centered around restorative justice practices and trauma-informed care. Our program breaks down organizational silos and places the needs of children and families at the forefront of our work. We know that in order to be successful, the child must be cared for as a whole and not in a piecemeal fashion. 
In addition to the stellar programs offered during the academic year, Glenwood Academy provides a powerful summer enrichment program. This program allows Glenwood students, as well as children in the community, to live on campus and engage in productive learning and extracurricular activities. Most of our students come from the west and south sides of Chicago, where summer has proven to be the most dangerous time of the year for them. Glenwood disrupts that pattern, providing a safe, nurturing, and empowering atmosphere for our students during the summer. Our summer enrichment program serves over 650 students and their families each year. See, Glenwood Academy is far more than just another private school. We are a community that empowers youth to realize their potential and find their own voice. As we impact the youth and their families, the greater community is served. Your generous support makes this possible. Thank you for investing in the future of our youth. By doing so, you are making a powerful impact for generations to come. My name is Grant Allison, and I'm a house parent here at Glenwood for nine years. My name is Tonisha Allison, and I'm also a house parent and have been here for nine years. We are parents that live at home with students, uh, typically between 10 to 12 students. So we raise them, you know, help them with homework, develop social skills, life skills, pretty much everything that you will see in a, in a regular home. There are so many activities that we do within the cottage and little programs that we create to kind of build sisterhood. We have teenage girls. And we like to cook together, we play games together, we go on field trips or outings together and we support one another. We build relationships with the students and the families and based on those relationships, we're able to kind of ascertain what each student's needs are. Working with the caregivers is absolutely important to the success of the students because if you have their support, then you're connected. You can't have one without the other. You can't build a bond with the, with the students and not a, at least attempt to build a bond with their guardians. And it's about knowing like the need and kind of the backstory of every student and every family and building off of that. We've served, you know, maybe over 100, you know, girls since we've been here at Glenwood. And I will say about 96% um, we're without a father. So I think that's one of the most meaningful things for me personally to be able to, um, you know, just model what, what being a father uh, really means. The most meaningful thing about being a house parent here is just seeing when those light bulbs turn on and you see those changes from, you know, month to month or year to year. Some of our students we've had since the sixth grade and they're seniors this year we were able to see change in their lives academically, socially, emotionally, or even their families' lives, where they were when they entered our cottages, not where they ended up. I think that's what is so special about it. Wow, now you can see why we love being here at Glenwood. All the great things you saw in the last segment are possible because of your support. Donations from people like you go directly to programs for us and other kids just like us. Not just the regular stuff like math and science, but things like art and music too. My old school didn't have that. Plus, all of the after school activities, we're busy, but we still have fun. Glenwood Academy is special. Being here has helped me see how much the world has to offer and all the things I can become. At Glenwood, nearly 100% of our programs are funded by donations. That is how important people like you are to us. Let's take a look at some of the programs your donations support. My name is Cynthia Hadnot. I'm the resource teacher here at Glenwood Academy, and I work with students who need assistance in their academic subjects. The Learning Resource Center at Glenwood provides assistance to students in basically uh, reading language arts, which includes their grammar skills and writing skills, and math skills. Many times I will work with students who need assistance with their science and social studies too. We try our best to give them the academic standards that they need to be prepared for high school. 
and uh, from elementary to middle to middle to high school. So I'm trying to work hand in hand with the teacher. Many times students are aware when they're in the resource that they might be a little behind. But the way it's learning resource is established here, it doesn't really stigmatize a student to the point. Many times they want to come to resource because they feel it's more fun. A tutor usually will just kind of define one area and work with the student in that and then build on it. But when you're working in the resource center, you're also looking at the whole student as far as how the student is functioning with all their skills, not just their academic skills, their emotional social skills, which is a big component of what we do here. We set goals and objectives. I let them write their own goals and objectives as well so they can kind of mesh with mine. Then they see the progress as we take the STAR assessment for reading and math. And then we keep going back. Okay, we have this part, but we don't have this part. Let's go back, Which, what else can we do? But eventually, the students start seeing that, aha, they have that aha moment. And I do have it. I got this now, I got this part, so let's go to the next part. I think that we all want for all our children are for them to be able to, to go out into the world and know that they have choices and that they're able to give back to the community, give something of themselves to the community. It takes a village. And, and, and here at Glenwood, that's exactly what we are. We, we're just all like one big umbrella. That includes the house parents, the staff that takes care of the grounds, of course all the teachers and people who volunteer here. As you walk into Glenwood, you just feel this strength, this energy, and it gives you a really, really good spirit that you're in the right place. And if our students can go out and project that in the world once they leave here, then we've done our job. My name is Diane Scruggs. I am the Director of Clinical Services for Glenwood Academy. We offer a variety of counseling services to the academy, not only to the students, but to their parents. We do a lot of solution-focused, brief treatment, trying to find out what's going on with children, what's going on with their families, because obviously, if there's something perplexing the family, it certainly has an impact on the children. A child is not a one-dimensional thing. Um, there are a number of things that impact children every day. When families come to the academy, they're struggling with domestic violence, sometimes incarceration, substance abuse, abandonment, a variety of things that impact their daily lives. Counseling makes an impact in two ways. One, it gives parents a safe place to talk about things that are hurtful, that are confusing, and that they oftentimes feel guilty about. I think from the perspective of children, when their parents are able to get counseling, more times than not, it makes how they parent better. And when we make the family better, we almost always make the student better. Children live in families. They do not live in isolation, whether it's siblings, a single parent, a father, grandparents, it, they all form their most immediate social network. Those are the people that they often model and learn behavior, learn how to interact in positive or negative ways. So if you do not work with the entire family constellation, your chances of success are less. But when you can impact all of them, or significant people in a child's life, you will see changes in that child. Glenwood Academy is a vibrant, one-of-a-kind residential education model that serves students, families, and their communities. Our whole family approach that addresses intellectual, emotional, physical, and social needs sets us apart from all others. We are committed to being a disruptive force in the cycles of poverty, injustice, and inequity for the communities we serve. This year, 100% of parents and caregivers report 
feeling that their children are safe at Glenwood. And 100% of students report that they feel that they have meaningful relationships with their peers and teachers. These are powerful statements of trust, hope, and confidence in Glenwood Academy held by those we serve directly. According to Harvard University, a growing body of evidence suggests that every child who experiences success has had at least one stable and committed relationship with a supporting adult. At Glenwood, we intentionally ensure that each student and their family are engaged in positive and meaningful relationships with our team. We believe excellence derives from knowledge, hard work, and innovation. During this academic year, our students were in the 81st percentile for student growth, with an average percentile growth rate of 12 percentile points. Our students achieved this in the midst of a global pandemic as they bravely adapted to remote learning and living. This is a testament to the power of resilience we build in our students and families, helping them to achieve big things. Learning and exposure to new things does not end in the classroom. Glenwood Academy requires 100% student participation in our after-school programming to engage students in new and creative things. Activities such as cooking, dance, robotics, and science clubs provide wonderful opportunities for our students to explore their gifts and talents while expanding their knowledge and skills. We are excited about what the future holds. As we continue to strive to advance our mission and empower our youth, we are grateful for the support of our donors and friends. We could not make these accomplishments without your support. Thank you for continuing to partner with us as we strive to eradicate poverty, injustice, and inequity through the power of residential education. That was awesome. I love all the great programs here. We are going places, right, Envy? I wish everyone could come to Glidwood. <laughs> That's right, Jakai. I guess we could say our future is so bright we have to wear shades. But that sounds like something an old person would say. But you can help more kids have bright futures. To help more children benefit from Glidwood, please donate by going to thanksgiving21.giftsmart.com or click the link below this video. Yes, your donation will go towards things like the Learning Research Center. Being at Glenwood has helped all of us. We're counting on you to help us make a difference. Listen to these powerful stories of how Glenwood has helped change our lives. Glenwood Academy is a residential school. This is a very safe environment. It is structured with so many different opportunities. First and foremost, their education, and then they get to explore. Here at Glenwood, they have an opportunity to be day students, or they can be a residential where they're here from Sunday drop off until Friday pick up. We're the only two in our household. Being a single parent, just needing some extra assistance with certain things of how to help along with DeMario and certain things with attitude, and that's why we came here. I'm Brianna Dorsey's grandmother. I lost my daughter nine years ago when I lost my child. I didn't know what I was gonna do because this was really hard on me. I have been a residential student. Bloom gives you the opportunity to do the same routine, get to see your teachers that you like. Coming here, I knew they're gonna be the parent to my child and raise her accordingly. It's been a lifesaver, it really has. We have three sons attending Glenwood Academy. It was definitely a great choice and decision for their futures. My old school wasn't as good as Glenwood Academy because I wasn't given that individual feeling, you know, uh, that individual care. It was a lot larger classes, and a lot of the time I felt like I was just kind of sitting there going through the day like it was a dream. I wasn't learning what I should have been learning. Inner city Chicago, South Side, the schools, underfunded, classrooms overcrowded, and you couple that with the fact that they were in crime-ridden areas. You're concerned about their safety and even yours. My other school was pretty dangerous at times. A lot of kids were always like bullying and like threatening each other. There was a lot of violence. I was like the shortest uh, person at my other school and I, I was getting bullied by many people. One time I was getting picked on at school and I brought something I shouldn't have to school. I brought a knife to school. 
I wasn't gonna do anything with it, but I was just gonna like try and like threaten the kid. And I made a terrible mis mistake bringing that thing to school. To get to a point where my son felt threatened so much, so he had to bring a weapon to school to protect himself from this other kid that was constantly bullying. And to find that out as a parent, it, it was a blow. That was an eye opener for us, for everyone involved. Here at Glenwood Academy, I feel like the teachers really do take time to like give you that one-on-one -on -one and really inspire you to do better and better yourself. DeMario is becoming more independent, which I'm very grateful for. Glenwood Academy helps you exceed. It helps you in areas you're struggling in. They work with the children, even in tutoring. The after-school programs, they have a lot of neat programs, and they get to pick and choose what they like. They're people who actually support you and root for you. When you're residential, you come home from school to one of the cottages and you have house parents. The house parents are always there for them. It's just like my own parents. Just, I went straight to them for advice or anything. You can go to them for anything. They have the support of counseling if they need it. She's going through this problem right now, I think, of really missing her mother at her age. I and mean, they would actually counsel me on where she's at how to deal with her from that point. The discipline, the structure, understanding what it means to work in a team environment. The children, once they grow up, they have to go out. And the impact that's made here with Glenwood will show. I wouldn't be the kid who I am today. I would be bad or I'd either be locked up or something if I didn't come to Glenwood. I didn't think I was gonna be able to do anything in my life. And then when I came here, I started exploring different things that I could be in life. Now, I just feel free. Like, I have a free choice to be whatever I want when I grow up. I'm hoping that I can stay here for a very long time, because this is the place that I want to be. Without donations, without support from sponsors, my boys wouldn't be able to attend Glenwood. They wouldn't have these opportunities that are right in front of them we can certainly see the change. It was a progression each year. You could see a difference. I can see them growing as young men, and they will be people that will help change the world. I think my future is gonna look pretty bright. Hi, my name is Mary Holly, and I'm president of Glenwood Academy. The stories you heard are just a few of the many stories we hear every day from our students and families. Thank you to our donors, sponsors, volunteers, and all of you who believe in our mission by investing in the work we do at Glenwood Academy. Your support makes it possible for our students and families to realize their potential and experience success in their lives. You are partnering with us to be a disruptive force in the cycles of poverty, injustice, and inequity for the students, families, and communities we serve. We simply could not do this without you. We especially thank our diamond presenting sponsors, Echo Brands, Robin and Pat Flynn, the James Family Charitable Fund, the Plain Family Foundation, Joanne and Tom Prescott, and Kim and Norm Wesley. And the committee who helped make this event possible, we appreciate your hard work and effort. And last, but certainly not least, Thank you to our amazing students who hosted this event and their wonderful families who shared their life stories. They are the reason we work hard every day to make a difference. And they are the reason your support means so very much to us. If you haven't already, please go to thanksgiving21.givesmart.com and make a secure donation to support the students and families of Glenwood Academy. Your support is transforming lives on a daily basis. And as you have seen here, it is having a tremendous impact. Please consider making a gift that is meaningful to you. Thank you again for joining us this evening.